There's our boat. What's up everybody? Thanks for joining me today here. Actually, yeah, uh, just got to Loggerhead Marina. It's already late in the day. It's almost one o'clock now, so I gotta run inside and tell them to get my boat down. We have a 33 SAV with a steering problem, so let me uh, run inside and we'll get the boat out and see what's going on. All right, let's jump on here and fire everything up. Get our batteries on here. Jump up here and turn it on and see if we got codes right away. If you look back here, you can see that our motors are actually at the wrong angle already. The rudder rudder is definitely off right now. Let's turn our key on. Get our optimus steering here. Alright, so right away you see 26 and 17. That should be exactly the same. Let's turn the wheel, see what it does. Nope. What do we have? Port, steering, pump, motor, driver, error. All right, let's jump down the hole here. Here, this is actually our PCM, which is the pump control module. This is what controls this pump and this pump so that the motors can steer independently. Here's your two leads, one from each motor here. If you turn around, you have both your breakers for that. So if we go here, we got a red light flashing here. When we're steering, this motor's not making any noise. This one makes noise here. So first, I'm gonna check power here. And then if it, we have power between both here, I mean, we've got good power to our unit here, we're gonna swap our plugs. And then if this, this motor activates and starts steering and this one doesn't, that means our box here has went bad. So let's see what we can figure out. All right, so we're set up, let's go to the side that works first, 12.6, perfect. Let's go over to our side that is not working, 12.6 also. All right, so we're showing good voltage to our PCM here. Now let's see if we can trick it and we'll swap those plugs and see if we can get the port side to turn and the starboard not to. That'll tell us if we have a bad motor or we actually have a bad PCM. All right, so here's our plugs for our motors on each side here. We're just gonna swap them All right, now let's see if she steers. All right, let's flip our key on and see if that port motor moves. Oh, did you see that? That was, that was the port motor. All right, so it looks like we figured out what was going on here. Our control box here is not uh, allowing any voltage out of it to control the motor. So it looks like we gotta get a new one of these control boxes ordered. Let me show you real quick what this system actually does. So we have our two pumps. Here and here, our lines go out to our steering ram, so this is hydraulic, it's electric over hydraulic. On the very back of the boat here, the Optimus steering sensor here, this is actually what controls where the rudder angle is. It's just a magnet that reads back and forth in the middle of this ram. There's a splitter for hydraulic fluid and it's magnetic. So this reads that little splitter back and forth so it knows exactly the degree of the motor. When we come up to our dash here, we actually have our steering wheel, which our helm here has no hydraulic fluid anymore in it or anything. It actually is just fly-by-wire at this point. And it's actually magnetic, so when you turn it, there's a magnet that'll stop the wheel from moving when you go lock to lock, so it doesn't just keep spinning. On an Optimus system, you get a gauge here that tells you your codes, the steering rudder angle. When you lose steering, this is actually what it shows you here. Put a neutral, you open the valves up to straighten them out, and then you uh, use your throttles to steer the boat forward and reverse to turn the boat and all that get back home. Here's your joystick. This actually uh, it's got a red light on it right now just because it ain't working. When this works it's very nice. Right next to the bow thruster you can control the boat pretty much on a dime with both of these together. That being said, I'm actually going to make a few phone calls so that I can get a new PCM coming. If you have any questions, go down below here and shoot me a comment. Hit all those buttons, subscribe, bell, all that fun stuff and I'll see you next time.